I need to talk to you about this product actually because this is gonna change your washing game, guys. I picked it up with the Biocarb, again, from Elbow Grease. We've got a theme here. Elbow Grease is, they are on point at the moment. Oh, excellent. That's just excellent. I buy the box that is open. Please don't leave on my bed. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to today's video. So I'm gonna be sharing with you everything I picked up in Home Bargains and today's haul is pretty huge, I'm not gonna lie. I think this is probably the biggest haul from Home Bargains that I've had on my channel. We've got a little bit of everything in here, just a little, the food is gone though, that's already gone in the drawers because nothing stays um, like put in the bags when it comes to food. So we've got some dupes in here, obviously cleaning supplies and lots of goodies from my ensuite which if you've been here for a while you're probably sick of me talking about my ensuite but it's now pretty much done it's working so we needed some supplies so we're going to jump straight into it because i'm conscious i don't want this haul to be like hours and hours long probably grab a drink though because i have got three bags here um that are quite filled so we're going to jump into it don't forget to give it a thumbs up leave me a comment down below and if you haven't already please don't hit forget to hit that subscribe button and join me here on youtube it really helps support my channel and i appreciate it so so much and we're going to jump into the haul okay so apologies that i sound a little bit um horsey i've got a cough a bad chest i've got all the bugs the kids have had so we're not feeling our best so we've got a little bit of makeup on to hide the bags um little miss penny she's my daughter if you're new here she's two she is here she's just playing literally just down in her bedroom so just down the stairs there so she's got her ipad and she's got this really cute board game that i got her from the charity shop which she's obsessed with so i'm sure she's going to come up um and feature but yeah i just wanted to let you know if you hear any background noise i'm not on my own um and i didn't want to wait any longer to film this haul because it's already been in my utility for a week so let's jump straight in so as you can probably see i had to buy a replacement flash mob now the weirdest thing happened i was cleaning my floor um and if you've seen any of my other vlogs you'll know that for breakfast i make myself like a smoothie shake because i can get all my like um like powders and vitamins and things like that all in one place and i can't taste it and it's just a good way for me to get it in I don't even know how this happened, but basically, I will put a picture up here, but the smoothie ended up on the floor, and the mop ended up with the top snapped off. Don't tell me how, because I wasn't near any of it. Don't know how any of it happened, but it happened. So, needed a new one. I was at Asta just doing a little, like, in-between food shop. Was gonna pick one up from there, and it was 30 pounds, and I was thinking, I know I bought my speed mop, like, my power mop, sorry, not my speed mop, I have to get this right, flash power mop i've got the speed mop as well so i get them mixed up but i know i bought my power mop like probably about four years ago four or five years ago but anyway got it from home bargains 20 pounds so if you need one or you want to pick up an amazing mop 20 pounds home bargains so this is like the starter kit so you actually get the mop the five of the pads the batteries and the solution um so yeah i need to go and mop my floor so i can't wait to get this out i've been i'm not joking you when i tell you i've been staring at this for a week because i refuse to unbox anything until i've done a haul especially when it's home bargains or b m so first purchase made me very happy okay the bag i'm literally just going to tip this out guys it's not in any order so apologies um i have in the past kind of structured it but I just kind of want to get through it to be honest so um oh there's something that i bought multiple of, so let me just grab that so hope you don't mind but we're just going to dip in and see what we get out so next up if you've not tried these yet you need to as you can see i'm obsessed so you get seven in a pack i don't know how much though did i keep the receipt will it be on this receipt will it be one pound 29 one pound 29 they're amazing um so i just recently did a washing machine clean and can you see these like little patterns here and it actually has elbow grease on it it's a bit of like a scour surface but very very gentle i just love these they last like a few times so i need to actually do all the pvc on my outside windows french doors that sort of thing and yeah i just love them so i had to get three packs because last time i went in they didn't have them for a while so obsessed um next up i had to get um the vacuum storage bags because although the weather's been awful the winter stuff is going away like the thick knits i'm just putting it away and my bags the one i have got the summer stuff in is actually split so i picked up another one so yeah we're gonna do a wardrobe transfer 
very soon. Um, I needed some new rubber gloves, so these are my favourite, the elbow grease. They, I think, I only ever see size medium. I'm sure they do other sizes, but whenever I go in, they only have, oh, they only actually do medium and large, it just says on the back. But yeah, I only ever see medium, but I love these. They're really, really durable and they last for ages. Sometimes I would like my nail would split through the top of other ones that I've had, um, but these don't and they last a really good amount of time. Like I can go a few months before I need to get a new pair. Um, if you can also hear rattling, my washing machine is doing its final spin. So I can just hear it sounds like the house is shaking. That is my washing machine. Um, I saw this knee support. Now, I don't know how good this is going to be, so I will report back. If you watch any of my other vlogs, stay tuned, because I'll do, um, I'm going to use this after I finish this video, because I do need to do a workout today. But my left knee is not in the best way. It clicks, and it's just really annoying, when, especially when I do squats and things like that. So I saw this, and I thought I would give it a go, because um, I find when it's really compressed, it doesn't, it's more the noise. If I, I have to wear AirPods, because I just can't cope with the noise. Um, but yeah, it was only a couple of pounds, so I thought I would give it a go and see see how I like it. Sorry, I just had to run down and check on Penny. Um, but yeah, next up, I just picked up some hairspray. Um, we don't need to use, use it that often, but I just wanted something here. I've heard good things about this one. Never tried it before, funnily enough. Um, so yeah, Darcy was quite excited when she saw this in the bag, so hopefully it's good. And then, really random, but we're going to Turkey in July, so I picked these up for Penny. Um, it says three plus on them, but um, I'm sure they'll be okay. If not, she can just wear them in the garden. Um, I think they were one ninety nine, but she's pepper obsessed, and I just thought, how cute is she gonna look with like a pepper on each side of her eyes? So yeah, I picked these up. She's really excited. Um, right, I'm gonna keep the receipt to hand in case there's anything I need to refer to. So we're going down to get one of the big, big bags, okay? And this was actually a two trip haul, so that's why there's a lot. Okay, next up, I picked up some of the magic erasers. Um, I've used the flash ones, which are amazing, and I also get a big set in Aldi, but I saw these in Home Bargains when I was there, and I thought I'd pick them up, because I've seen um, on Mrs. Hinch's Instagram, she cleans her tile grout with a magic eraser, and it's actually like what what it does to her tile grout is pretty insane so i thought i have to give it a go because my tile grout in the kitchen is just not not a vibe it's just stained and horrible in our ensuite the grout is pure white and i want it to stay that way so i thought i'm going to keep one of these upstairs um i'm gonna do like a little cleaning caddy for the bathroom because i've got different stuff which will be coming up in a minute um but yeah if you've tried that let me know if it works next up i got a box of tissues just because like i said we've all had the dreaded bug that's going around and we need some tissues okay, i also picked up another one of the magnesium bath flakes um i love to pop these in the bath um i also use the epsom salts um for like muscle recovery they're really good as well they usually have a big bag but they didn't have it so i just got this one because i've got those glass jars if you would have seen from my other i think that was my last home bargain so actually i just keep it in like a nice glass jar down in the main bathroom but yeah another bag of those um and then i've got clifford our dog some tennis balls the dog loves a tennis ball um we'll shred them but he loves a tennis ball so i got him a little treat and then we've got some iron in water just for Sunday nights. My favourite job to do, not ironing the school shirts. Um, but I just love using the iron in water. So this is my favourite one. It's the Fresh Sky one and it's completely dented, but that's fine. Okay, what else? What's next? What's next? I feel like... I feel like there's... Ah, right. So next up, another bathroom purchase. Um, these are three for six pounds, so I did just grab three of them. So it's the new Vacay Vibes edition, Mrs. Hinch, Orange Blossom and Coastal Cypress. Cypress? Cypress? Three of exactly the same. That one's on the floor. Because I did pick one up individually and it smells incredible. Actually, everything from this range um, smells incredible. The Speed Mop Wipes, the laundry um combo oh, just my favorite one so far so yeah three of those six pen they do last ages and i've now got obviously three toilets which is hello. annoying but the perfect one hello and it's gonna come and join me for a little bit she's a little bit under the weather as well so she's gonna help mummy do her haul aren't you do you want to help mummy do her haul do you want to play with my hair okay um so yeah i'm gonna pop one of those in each of the bathrooms 
And then I also picked up a double pack of the um, rim blocks, is that what you call them? I really like these astonished ones. They're really, really cheap. They're a lot cheaper than the other um, combo pack in there and I just love it. It doesn't stain, oh, I think it's the blue ones, um, as in like blue, B-L-O-O. -O. Um, they're like pink and blue, but they actually run down the toilet pan and stain it. So um, these are lovely and it smells super fresh. But next up, I just picked up a pack of the bathroom wipes. These are my favorite ones. I think they're like 59p, um, but I just love them for the bathroom cleaning. So I just picked up this one so I can just pop it in the storage bin in the ensuite. And then toothpaste. And then really random, but we needed a pepper, a black pepper grinder. <laughs> um, and I've been struggling to find one in Aldi really oddly when we've been doing our weekly food shop. So saw one in Home Bargains and grabbed that. I have to take that one downstairs, won't we, baby? Thank you. Yeah. Um, next up, I got a pack of the cooling gel sheets just to pop across your head. Um, just for if the kids have got a headache, I actually use it as well when I've got a headache. I just love them. It kind of okay. So when you've got a headache, you put it on your head and it gives you a bit of it makes the headache go away. Um so yeah, they're really, really cheap in a home bargain. So I just grabbed a pack of those. And then this is oh no, this is for the whole house. So well this is to clean the glass. Yeah. So I don't know if this is a new product, I think it may be because I've never seen it before, um, but it's Elbow Grease Glass Cleaner um, and I pretty much, I just love everything from Elbow Grease, I love their um, multi-purpose spray, I think it's like a degreasing spray, not the yellow one, it's in um, like a pink limited edition colour, I love that bottle, I've just repurchased it actually but I got it from B&M, um, so yeah I thought I would give that a try and I'm pretty certain I've got a bathroom one which is in the next bag so yeah, I thought I would give that a go. Let me know in the comments if you've tried this or if it is new. I've never seen it before. Um, I also got a dry shampoo. I picked this up the first time trying it, I think a couple of months ago, because I don't use it that often. It's only like when we're desperate and we need a hair wash. Um, and I really loved it. It did a really good job. Didn't leave any like white powdery marks in my hair um, or residue mm. in my hair and yeah, it's a really big size so it lasts for a while so I thought I would repurchase that so I've got some hair and we've got some paracetamols and then just some of the smaller bin liners. I like these for um, like the bathroom bins and the bins in the bedroom, they're kind of like the perfect size so I've just got those. And then last up in this bag, you wouldn't believe how long it's taken me to get hold of this, um, but it's the Flash Spray Wipe um, Sparkling Bathroom. Oh, so this is the bathroom one, is it? Well, I'm going to use it everywhere, but um, it's the Hinch Vacay Vibe Scent. Do they do a separate bathroom and a multi-purpose one then, or is it just bathroom? I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you know. Um, but yeah, I got that. It took me ages to get my hands on this, so I am excited to try this one. Okay, oh my goodness me, this one's heavy. So, it's excuse okay. the fact it's in an it's Audi okay. bag, guys. It is a broccoli, good girl. I just grab whatever bag's in the boot of my car. Obviously, it's an Audi bag in today's video. So, I'm gonna show them what we've got. So I picked up this nail brush, um, just because I needed one. Her and Ollie in the garden, their favorite thing is to put his diggers through the mud. So when you've got dirty in your fingernails, what do we do in the bath? We go like that and make them nice and clean, don't we? And I actually love their little bath section. It's like more of a natural range with bamboo, like handles. They've got so many different things and like body scrubs, like exfoliating pads. So cute. It's like really aesthetically pleasing to the to the eye. Um, but yeah, I think this was about 29p. It was super cheap. You're going to hold that for mummy? Huh? You hold that for mummy, yeah? Hold that brush for mum while I just want to... I'm going to show everyone else what's in the bag and you hold that for mum, yeah? Is that okay? Okay, so this is the other product I was talking about. So the, again, it's elbow grease, so it's the bathroom mousse. So I think I think it must be new because I've never seen anything like this, but I thought with me now having a shower to clean, I'm beyond excited for the shower, guys, I'm sorry. And you're probably so bored of me talking about, no, it's not for hair, it's for nails. I know you're probably bored of me talking about this en suite, but it's taken two years to get it to this point and I'm just excited. Um, so yeah, obviously I had to buy a little cleaning product for it. So let me know if you've used this before. Um, elbow grease, so I'm hoping I love it because I do love everything else. My bed, if you could see, can you see all of that? I've got to put this away after. 
Um, right, next up we've got a washing up liquid, again in the Mrs Hinch Vacay Vibes edition. Um, I love this washing up liquid, it's just the best. I pop it obviously in all the Dishmatics, all the Scrub Daddy um, ones that I've got and it's just such a great product to use on pretty much everything. I did a washing machine clean the other day, like I said, and I pretty much just used white vinegar and I put this in the Dishmatic with some white vinegar and it did amazing. I didn't even use a washing machine cleaner. So um, stay tuned for that video because I've done that. I think I've done it as a more of a reel and a YouTube short. Oh, are you okay? She's a poorly, she's a poorly girl. Um, yeah, so I will get that up ASAP. I'm just obviously like trying to put myself in about 50 different places at once. Um, I also got a couple of packs of this card. So this was from the Easter range. I did share this in my earlier haul. This is for Penny to do her drawing on and it was in the clearance aisle. I've never really seen a clearance aisle in um, Home Bargains, but they had so many good bits. And it was reduced to 50p a pack, so I got her two packs because she actually loves doing um, colouring, stickers, um, don't go painting. So yeah, she's got that out on the table at the moment. So we'll go and put those papers down there and you can do some more drawing, yeah? Can you do that now and I'll use this hand to get my stuff out? That'll be really helpful. Okay, next up, I need to talk to you about this product actually because... This is gonna change your washing game, guys. Um, so I randomly picked this up, I think in my last haul, so I'm pretty sure that was up in like February time. And I picked it up with the Biocarb, again, from Elbow Grease. We've got a theme here, Elbow Grease is, they are on point at the moment. So I picked it up to try, because usually I use the Star Drops white vinegar. Yeah. Anyway, I have been popping a cap full of this. Again, I'm probably not new to the game, I'm probably really behind. But I, I have to mention it because I've just got my mum onto it or my sister's onto it. I pop a cap full of this in with my washing, yeah. regardless of what colour it is. I've been putting it in my darks, don't know if that's right or wrong. And I'm not joking, my washing is so soft. Like, the softest. My bedding is soft. I know I've heard of, to put it in with towels because it can make them lovely and bouncy. Um, I know what you're thinking, because when I mentioned this to one of my other friends, she said, but does your not washing not smell of vinegar? It doesn't, it actually doesn't. You cannot smell any trace of it. It's obviously keeping the washing machine clean and please give this a go. And this one is really good. Because it's concentrated, you only need a small amount. Um, but yeah, go to Home Bargains, grab yourself a bottle of this and pop it in your washing and come back and then let me know in the comments. Thank me later. Okay, guys. Not yet, we still got some more bits. Um, I've also picked up some little floss brushes. I need to get better at that. I always get told off by the hygienist when I go, so I saw it, thought, let's let's sort ourselves out. Um, I also got a new Febreze. Again, do I even need to tell you what scent is in? Literally, the scent is all the same. So it's the um, VK Vibe scent. So yeah, I had to pick this up. Um, I don't ever get the aerosol version because I don't use that. I just prefer this version. But if you do like the aerosol, like more of the air freshener, they have it in that scent as well. Oh, it's just, honestly, guys, it's so good. Like, so good. Um, now, I've got this huge hand wash for the ensuite because I've bought in B&M. Um, stay tuned for my upcoming vlog because I'm going to do a bit of a tour of the ensuite and it needs to have a clean because obviously after it's been renovated there is dust and dirt everywhere. But I bought this really nice stone um, pump pot on a like tray and I thought I would pop this in there just because it looks nicer in the window than this pink one. But um, I just thought it would peony, love a bit of a peony scent. So yeah, should last for ages as well. And then we have got... A little present for Tom for Father's Day. He doesn't watch my videos, so well. This is for Daddy for Father's Day. I saw this and I thought it was quite handy, you know, it might come in handy for me as well. Um, a six in one hammer and screwdriver set. So um let me show you the back actually, that's probably more helpful. Their aisle actually at the moment for Father's Day, they've got some really cute little bits and pieces down now, really affordable. For Father's Day. For Daddy. We're going to wrap it up and give it to Daddy. Maybe next time I go down, I'll film a few clips um, in case you can't, you haven't got one local to you um, or you've not been recently. But yeah, I thought that was a really cute little 
idea and something he will always use because he's always doing bits and pieces around the house. So next up, I've just picked up this little um, face cloth. It's the Muslim facial cloth in the Bath and Body, well, it's from the Bath and Body collection. They, Like I said, they've got really cute things. They've got like little headbands, the little wrist guard so the water doesn't run down your wrists. Um, so I'm making her like a little beauty bag for her birthday. So I just picked that up. I think it was about 59p. It was really, really cheap um, just to pop in her bag. And then I've also got a little dupe for myself. So um, this is a dupe of the Sol de Janeiro sprays. They did have all of the scents in there. So the orange, the pink, and then this is the red one. Um, I went with this one. So this is the Cherry Bomb and Jasmine Blooms. I love a jasmine scent. Um, 3 dollars Can't go wrong. Now, my daughter actually has the actual Sol de Janeiro ones. And I will say... There is hardly any difference in them, um, other than the fact it doesn't say Sol de Janeiro on them. So they also do the moisturiser pots as well, a little bit like the, um, not Bum Bum Cream. Yeah, it is, it's the same brand, isn't it? So yeah, a little bit like the Bum Bum Creams. I've got one of those because they came in one of my gift bags that I've got, um, my edit bags that I bought last year. And Darcy, my daughter, has got the little pink one. Um, so when I can see those in a local store i will grab a few and let you know what i think of them but yeah i do love that so if you do see these i would highly recommend getting one lovely just a spritz on every day okay i also picked up another little polish spray i think i said this in my last um haul i prefer these ones rather than the traditional polish spray they seem to just repel the dust for longer. I don't know what magic they're putting in this, but I think this is a newer scent, Cherry Blossom. Um, it's a slightly smaller one, so I thought I would just pick it up and see how I like it. And then I got a Dettol spray. So I think they've changed their cans because I remember them being shorter and wider than this, but um, I needed a new one. I like to spray the bin every time I like use it and wipe it down and the handles, things like this. I just, this Dettol spray is actually really, really, really good. Um, and this is in the limited edition. So I did have the wipes in this and they smell amazing. So I thought I would grab this one as well. And then last up guys, again, a couple of little purchases for the ensuite. Um, I've just got some stackable cubes. So these are 99p. I've got the bigger ones. I'll link my last home bargains haul down below because they are in that haul. But these ones were 99p and I just thought to go under the kit, uh, the kitchen sink, no, it's not a kitchen um, to go under the bathroom sink for things like tampons, um, like cotton rounds, things like that. It's just easier to keep it all in one place and I can obviously stack them on top of each other to save a little bit of space. Um, so I am going to be living my best life organising th this bathroom after we finish this video. But yeah, I thought that was really good for 99p and they're really like thick and sturdy. They're not flimsy at all. So their um, storage at the moment they've got in there is really, really impressive. Okay, that is going to wrap up today's haul. So I really hope you enjoyed. Like I said at the start, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you've not already, I'd really appreciate if you'd hit that subscribe button. It isn't a fee or anything. I know the word subscribe can kind of put people off. It's literally essentially like a follow button. So if you would please follow me on YouTube by hitting the subscribe button, I would really, really appreciate it. Um, but I am gonna take my poorly little princess and we're gonna, please love this to me guys. I've got to go and find homes for this now. Um, we're gonna go and put all this away, aren't we? And we're gonna go and have some lunch and have some snuggles. And we will see you in our next video, which is a weekly vlog. Bye everyone!